Financial is making over their parking lot today and giving it a Hawaiian vibe. From the fashion to the food, the Valley Today's Abby Furchner joins us live with details on this afternoon's luau. Good morning, Abby. Good morning, you guys. Yeah, I'm here at Choice Financial on 23rd Avenue South and it is the parking lot is smelling delicious at 11 a.m. Everyone is going to be filling it with Hawaiian shirts. And I'm here with Tracy Cap Capron with Hospice of the Red River Valley. And you guys, Hospice covers 29 counties in North Dakota and Minnesota. So why is Hospice so important? Because we help anyone living with a life-limiting illness or serious illness live as well and fully as they can. We want to make sure that they're treated with uh, respect and dignity and have the comfort. And so why do you guys team up with Choice Financial for this event? Because we could not do the services and provide the expert care to this community without the support of people like Choice Financial. This is an amazing event and we have to make sure we thank them. But also this community, the generosity and support is unbelievable. And this is your sixth year. So yeah. what are you hoping for this year? Okay, they said 2,500 people. I'm oh saying three. Can we have 3,000 yes, people? Absolutely. Okay. And yeah. you guys have a goal of 150,000 people, correct? Absolute. $150,000. Dollars, not yeah. people. Oh my gosh, could you imagine? Could you imagine? People. That would be amazing. No, it would, because you'll see tons of people here, great food. I mean, the volunteers, they're already here working since like 4 a.m. So come out and join us. And yeah. we're going to take one last peek at this pig. We have with Choice Financial who's going to lift up the top for us. Oh my goodness. This is the food you guys are going to be able to eat if you come out from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. at the Choice Financial on 23rd Avenue. It's right next to the old Chicago. There is a $5 um, suggested donation, but if not, just come out, join the party, and have some fun. It is going once again from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. Um, it is just going to be an overall blast. It's just going to be so much fun. And all those proceeds do go to Red R Hospice of the Red River Valley. And I I heard the first 100 people who donate $50 will get a $25 Doolittle gift card. So, I mean, all those proceeds go to hospice to help hospice. They the giving do. They actually continues. go to provide direct patient care. We take our money because it's community-owned hospice, and that money is used to take care of our community. There you go. So you want to get out here from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. An easy organization to support. It yes. really is. And I know that Lisa wants to borrow my coconut bikini, but that one I is do. mine this oh, year. Gosh. Sorry, you're not allowed to wear that it. That so away. I might. <laughs> All right. Abby Furchner reporting live. Thank you very much.